<clears throat> welcome back, welcome back. Last time on Dragon Ball Z, Videl got her ass kicked in a not cool way. Um, she needs a sense of being, and Goku said he will go get it for Gohan. Yeah, go to Kami's Lookout and get a sense of being from Corrin. We were able to do quite a bit last time. We registered with the World Martial Arts Tournament. Bulma helped us. Well, not Bulma. We trained up Trunks and Go. I mean, yeah, Trunks and Gohan. We can use this time to get Goku a bit higher leveled, cause uh, who knows when we're gonna have the opportunity. So there's that. Yeah. Let's see if we can uh, find any of those planes flying around. There's one. <laughs> yes. What I may do every episode is do like a few minutes in the beginning of just boosting levels. Just so that everyone's in a good uh, constant progression. So let's quickly, if that's the case. Kami, you can wait a bit. Well, Dende. I will say, I, did, I do like this. I wish they had this in uh, Legacy of Goku 2. Just these random spots that, like, villains would pop up in. That was a cool feature. It made you want to go, like, actually go looking around for these things. It was, it was a good concept. Let's go check out the woods south of our house. What's Chi-Chi gonna do? Be mad that we swung by home without her? Also, we know we can't open that door. Over here, so that's that. That's the other thing. Oh shit, I forgot about the money part. If we're lucky, we can work on saving up for our, um, those two Hercule exhibits. Because how much does that need we got? Yeah, we got 7,500,000. Now, 100? 7,500. Saving. Yep. I'm close to leveling up too, so I'm not that worried. Bum, 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 bum. Goku can't open the gate. I'm trying to think. Maybe it's Goten? No. Vegeta's blue, Goku's orange, Piccolo's always been green. So I gotta assume it's Piccolo. But can we even play as Piccolo in this one? Uh, Boo's Fury. Uh, da, 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 da. 
hit points. No. I'm, I'm just, you know. Operator, scouters. Items, key item, Zenny. Save circle, flight circle, world map circle. Uh, buttons. Options. Character gates, here we go. Okay. Okay, so that door that we saw, that the one over here, it's Gohan's. Orange is Goku, green is Gohan, Goten is teal, Trunks is purple, Vegeta is blue, and Gotenks is um, gray. Okay. Yeah, so we do not get to play as Piccolo at all in this one. That's fine, I just forgot, so now we got it, like, covered. I didn't think we play as Piccolo, because I think this, I remember this one being like, no, you just play as the five Saiyans. Because, like, if you think about it, they're the ones who actually save the world. But I wasn't 100% positive, so now we know. I hate how I had, like, go combing through an actual, like, 2,000-something walkthrough on GameFAQ to find out that what the answer was. No one was sharing it. Um, let's see. Got a quick save in. What level are we at? 67. I kind of I, I want us to get to at least 7. Again, it, it, it's definitely a case of, um, I don't know how often we're going to have these moments to just relax and not be like, go, 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 go story. And I'd rather have that than like struggle on a section or worse, um, not struggle on a story, but can get somewhere where it's like, oh shit, we could have trained here and it would have been better. If that makes sense. Besides, for Legacy of Goku 2, we did that whole, like, what? Five, yeah, five hours of just maxing everybody out? If I do this, maybe we'll get lucky and I won't need to do that at the end. I'm being incredibly optimistic. It's probably going to still happen. It's a fucking Game Boy game. I bet it's going to happen to some degree. Sixty-eight. Yeah, two more levels. off going to West City. The fucking circus had a lot. Ooh, that's an idea, actually. I wonder if they still have them all at the circus. <laughs> really quick. To West City. I'm not saying that these guys are like. Was it West City? No, it's Hercule City. Yes. No. Yeah, it's Hercule City. Where is Hercule City? Is it near West City? I don't remember where it is.
There's West City. Goku, you're a terrible parent. You don't know where your own son goes to school. She's Island. No, but seriously, what the fuck is uh, her? Legacy of Goku Green. Should be right around. Yep, there we go. It's not all marked on the map. Good thing I think good thing there's no time limit on her uh Videl's health. Okay, this would be bad. Just what I hoped for. Two hundred fifty-six arm health. Okay. So that's. This was exactly what I was hoping for. Even the crap out of you guys is gonna definitely yield better results. That tank is just dropping like all kinds of shit. Can't touch me, bastard. level hell yeah be like when the game works with me I'm happy happy because like I can get shit done Guys are just so squishy. Also, I still think that, like, given that whole, like, in Legacy of Goku 2, they reveal that Goku reached the ability just to hold Super Saiyan indefinitely without, like, strain. Going regular Super Saiyan for Goku and Gohan, sh well, for any of them, shouldn't be an issue. It should be going two and three that are the. The physical demands. Because they did make that point in the show and the game that, like, they were able to just physically maintain it without effort. I know it's a game mechanic, but still, it's just one of those, hmm, consistency much? 70? 70. <laughs> one shot, that fucker. Man is dead. See how long this tank holds up against Super Saiyan? Not long at all. What 
What do we have for Zenny? 10,000. Okay, so that's not bad. Ooh, that's definitely not bad at all. So knowing that we can get, uh, to, what, 10,000? Yeah, 10,000 Zenny. Fairly easily, it's good to know. Oops, no, back. We want this one, this one, and that one. Hold up. Could be, could be money. Nope, it's just fights. Just the fighty fights. There. There. Sometimes they have a chest. But no, um... No, that's, that's really good to know. The, just... Good to fucking know. Quick save Arena, cause you never know. Always say whatever you can. Hello Goku, welcome to the lookout. It's supposed to be the garden of the earth, but there's so little I can do to help. I wish I could do a better job. Dende, you're doing fine. Too hard on yourself. Roby and Corin. Hello, Goku. What's going on? I'd appreciate it if you could bring me some fish. Yeah, Jarobi keeps the fridge stocked with pizza and fried chicken, but I'm hungry for fish. Hey, Goku. Oh, man. You want sensu beans? You know I have better things to do than grow sensu beans for you all day. Here, take one. There you go. Next time, I think I'll start charging. If I remember correctly, canonically, there's a reason why there is so few Senso Beans during the Boo Saga. And I think it's because they said the soil it takes to grow them is becoming, like, unmaintainable. And, uh, Corrin and Yajirobe are just, like, unable to maintain the crop. Which makes sense, because if you, just by watching Dragon Ball Z, you see that, like, the Z fighters go through them a lot. Every chance they get, they they take more and more from Corrin. Oh, fuck it. Fill, fill us up. So it does make tons of sense that the, that the crop would be eventually be, like, worthless. That being said, I'm surprised they never used the dragon to be like, oh, can you just make more soil that's that, you know, can cultivate it? Or make it easier to grow them, even. We don't need drinks, we don't need food. Okay, I gotta see how much it costs. Sure. 250,000. No, 25,000. Okay, so okay, it is possible. Definitely is possible. Did you get the Senzu bean? Great. Thanks, Dad. I'll take it from here. Hey, Vidal, I have something for you. Hey, you, leave Vidal alone. She needs a rest. You got some nerve. Here, take this. It's a sensu bean. It'll make you feel better. You think you can impress my daughter with some kind of bean? Trust me, sir. It'll make her feel good as new. There is no way I'd trust you. Please, Dad. 
I trust you, Gohan. And I know it'll help if you say it will. Listen, I have to run or I'll be late for my torment match. See you later. Yeah, you better run. You better stay away from my daughter. Fidel, no, no, spit it out. Amazing. I'm all better now. It's like I was never even hurt. Here we go with the fourth match of this competition, Kabito versus the Great Saiyan Man. Without his anything, is it just me or does the Great Saiyan Man look like Gohan? Well, the hairdo looks similar. Hey, I think you're right. That is Gohan. So he's been the Great Saiyan Man all along. We should cheer for him. He needs our support. You can do it, Gohan. Come on, go on! Show us what you got! Oh no, my helmet! In all the excitement, I forgot it! Go on! I'm curious to see your Super Saiyan powers. Show them to me. We may be able to use them. What? Hey! How do you know I'm a Super Saiyan? What do you mean, we may be able to use them? You'll know in time. Show me your Super Saiyan powers now. This is some kind of joke? I can't transform in front of all these people. What should I do? Do what he says, Gohan. Alright then, you asked for it. Yes. Do you just want to see a Super Saiyan, or should I take it up to the next level? What? There's a le level beyond Super Saiyan? Hey, look, Yamu. All that energy, it must be him. It can't be. Go hunt the Great Saiyan and the Gold Fighter? Impossible. This is unreal. What enormous energy. He's far stronger than I expected. Are you ready now? What's the matter? Come on and fight me. Mm -hmm. Got them both. Even though, like, that's gonna happen, so, like, I don't get why the fight was even needed. Oh, they're killing him! Trust me, you'll be fine. Stay back. Someone has to help him. He's in trouble. Gohan is in no danger. Hang in there, Gohan. It's almost over. We have all the pure energy we need. Let's go. All of you, stay where you are. Kabito will take care of Gohan now. He has no need of your assistance. At least tell us what's going on. There's no time for that. I had to follow them and find out where they took in, they're taking Gohan's energy. And I'm going with you. Very well. I could use your help. I know I'm going to regret this, but I'm going to. I know what you're doing. You're trying to sneak out of our match, aren't you, Kakarot? In case you haven't noticed, Vegeta, something more important is going on. You listen to me. We're scheduled to fight after the next two matches. I only entered this stupid tournament to fight you. I will not be denied. Take it easy, Vegeta. Fine, I'll put it on my to-do list. You forgot that you can only stay one day on this world. I have to fight you today or I might never get a chance. I'm coming with you to make sure you don't try to pull any of your tricks. Where's everyone going? Quiet, you must stay still. There, that should do it, go on. Great, I feel better now. Hey, what's going on here? Follow me and I'll tell you everything. Gohan, before you go, I need to know something. Yeah, what is it? Seven years ago, there was a strange group of fighters that showed up during the fight with Cell. And there was a, that little boy who was with them. That was you and your friends, wasn't it? Yeah. Then, 
It wasn't my father who beat Cell. It was you. Yeah, it was. I knew it. It always seemed like something was fishy about my dad's story. It all makes sense. I'm glad to know the truth. Thank you, Gohan. Now go, be a hero again. We needed to use Spopovich and Yamu to find the wizard who's controlling them. A wizard? Yes, when the human race was still in its infancy on Earth, a powerful wizard named Bibidi appeared. With him, he brought a terrible monster whose only purpose was destruction. That monster's name was Majin Buu. This monster's only desire was to el eliminate all living things. Hundreds of planets were reduced to rubble by him. Entire galaxies were wiped from existence. That sounds awful. So what happened to him? After a while, Majin Buu became so powerful that even Bibidi could not control him. Bibidi used a spell to seal Majin Buu inside a ball where he lay dormant. Bibidi used the spell to transport Buu from planet to planet until the ball was brought here to Earth. The Earth was meant to be Buu's next target. No, that's terrible. But before Boo could be released, Bibbidi was killed. The ball containing Boo has remained here on Earth to this very day. I don't get it. Why couldn't someone destroy Boo while he was inside the ball? That's a good question. As long as Bibbidi could never do the spell to release Boo from the ball, Boo was no longer a threat. However, Bibbidi had a son. Actually, it's a clone. He named his son Bobbidi. Bobbidi is on Earth right now. As we speak, he intends to continue his father's work and unleash Majin Buu upon the universe once again. I see. So what do Spopovich and Yamu have to do with all this? Babidi is not physically very strong, but as a wizard, he does not need to be. Instead, his magic enables him to harness the evil that exists in the hearts of people like Yamu and Spopovich, thereby control their actions. In order to res resurrect Majin Buu, Bobby requires a tremendous amount of pure energy. So they came after me. That's right. The Supreme Kai, the one you know as Mr. Shin, was the one who defeated Bibidi so many ages ago. I have to come to Earth to stop him. I see your father and the others up ahead. Let's catch up with them. Hey, Dad. Go on. I suppose Kabito has filled you in. Yep, sounds like we have our work cut out for us. I see Spopovich and Yamu landing over there, everyone. Try to suppress your energy. We don't want them to know we're here yet. Cool as fuck way to do, like, exposition. Make travel. Totally love that. Spopovich and Yamu landed somewhere around here. This is very strange. We've searched this area before and found nothing. Bobbidi's spaceship must be hidden somewhere around here. We should split up. That way we can cover more ground. Goku and Vegeta are now available. Okay, so what levels are everybody? 75. So the best thing we can do right now is get everyone to 75, because Vegeta's the highest leveled. Like, that's just a given. Yeah, it's a Goku gate for 70, but the point is, like... Oh, that's the only way to go. If that's the case, we're gonna go... We're gonna go, tra we're gonna go train in her pussy. Or, you know, just in general. Bum, bum, bum. Doo -doo -doo. Uh, bum. Getting uh, 10 levels between Goku and Gohan shouldn't be too hard. Again, the idea being, I want to get, uh... I 
I want everyone to be close enough in level where I don't have to worry about like, oh, one person's overpowering the rest. And also this will be a good place for getting Zeni. Hell yeah, 71, 71. Slow-ish, but like... Not as quickly as a battle thing, but it's fine. terrible for experience that time just not being super sane really kind of kneecapped us so taking out the tank is easier when we're super sane how much is any we got eleven thousand two Also, like, I know this arc is weird in, like, the anime, because, like, you, you, where you think the different saga breaks up, breakups are, aren't where they, th they would be. This is definitely, like, a, I feel like every chapter is happening quick, quicker than it should. So I keep feeling like, oh shit, we're, we're progressing way too quick. But I know it's not the case, it's just weird. thousand twelve thousand get fucked get fucked come on come on come on Plenty of shit. Oops, hold on. Yep. Thank you. 
No, fuck, what the kid gonna do? Gonna go here. That's what we're gonna do. Okay. Switch to Goku. Um. And let's see what happens when we go to the Goku gate. Like, I I'm curious as to what's behind it. If this if, if there's things to fight there, then I'll fight there. Versus like keep running in that circle, because that would just get boring as shit. Bam. Doo -doo -doo. Southwest Forest. Okay, switch to Goku. It's a good thing we uh, got Goku level up for today. some areas. Oh, just a Majin fighter. Damn, that was a lot of experience, okay. Definitely get some bonuses out of you guys. Everyone caught up with Vegeta should not be hard with this split with these guys. Oh, but -ba -ba -ba, I'm loving it. See, it's good thing I did this versus um, go back to Hercule City as Goku. We'd be running in circles for the whole hour. With this, we can just cut that time like drastically down. Are we just running in circles? Yes, but like, payoff is way higher. So much better. Looking at Zenimar's anyway, 13,000? Okay, it's not terrible. The way I see the money part of things, so long as we don't go like shopping, shopping, we just like avoid as much as possible, I don't foresee a problem. Turn to you. Oh, just another Majin soldier. Got it. Cool. 
level two transmission. Okay, so we got Goku to level 75. Back to get Gohan because we want to get Ooh, a belt. Oh, these guys are so easy. To well, not easy, but like so awesome to fight. Hell yeah. Seventy-seven. I may want to get everyone to level eighty. Like if this. If this is the experience amount they give us. Yeah, it may be good to just get everyone to level 80. Also because I want to be able to fight these guys in a way that they I don't have to like struggle. Yeah, let's switch to uh Gohan. So how much we got? Thirteen thousand. Yeah, this this area could give us the money we need, without question. Look at that chicken leg. Four gave us one level. Not seeing a downside to just like spending the last bit of this episode getting us to level like 80. are not that strong. And Senko, ha, level two. Ooh, a chest. Nice. I think those are reflexive, I mean, reflect, reflective gloves. Seventy-eight, seventy-six. Here's the other reason why we're fighting them. All the things they're dropping is going to totally be helpful long term. Get Vegeta to 77, we'll, we'll just rotate through. Definitely a worthwhile training episode. Final Flash, Big Bang. Vegeta is the same as we left him in Legacy of Goku 2. Just angrier. Angrier because, you know, it's Vegeta. Seven years of anger built up. Holy fuck. He 
Yeah, definitely gonna be good for like all the equipment uh, farming. Can definitely help us long run. Seventy-seven. Give you the three more levels you need to get to eighty. Vegeta's happy face in this game is kind of creepy. Just like that whole like yeah. I don't know what that is. It's meant to be a belt. 78. Okay. A few more levels. <laughs> I love the big bang attack. Just on principle. What if we took the spirit bomb and made it like way more devastating and petty? Because the Big Bang attack is way more pettier than the Spirit Bomb. Tuxedo. That can't do anything actually practical for, like, defense or anything. That level hell yeah. Level eighty. So we got one to level eighty, that's not bad. Very good, very good. Samurai scale armor. Expensive looking, it does only for endurance. Okay. Oh, they're dirty. Okay. I get you. Wait, wait to boots slow you down but give you more experience. Ooh, give me that. Definitely a Vegeta thing. Oh, it's a monocle. Gives you a lot of charisma. Gives you power and endurance. Okay. Yeah, the weighted clothing is definitely the way to go for Goku and Vegeta. Get the reflective. on the monocle, I guess. Oh, wait. Yeah, I barely even noticed the speed drop for Goku. Not that he doesn't have a drop, but I'm just not noticing it enough to be like, oh, that's a problem. 
Especially when it comes to um, experience boost, I'll take it. Yeah, because look at that. Three people, it was pretty much a three person boost to get to a level. I'm okay with that. Thanks, buddy. Your shot doesn't even matter. Let's get the money. You got the money, honey. We got your disease. Jungle. Welcome to the jungle. Ignoring the whole, like, you know, Majin fighters, I wonder how terrifying it would be for any normal human being to just be, like, training in the woods, doing their own little thing, all of a sudden, like, Goku or those guys flies out at you. Ready to throw down. And there's, like, nothing you can do. It's like, how are you going to stop them? Look at the shit they can do. They, no, nothing any of us could do would stop one of the Z fighters. We'd be lucky if we walked away un, like, permanently damaged. So Goku's at level 80? Yep. God damn it. Okay. Alright, Goku's done. Get Gohan. Wrapping the episode up, getting Gohan to level 80. Other good thing about doing all this farming. And yes, there are multiple good things. Hopefully, because the gate was level 70, us being 10 levels higher means that we will not have to worry as much about any like boss battles we encounter. Which happens. Goku 2 when we actually like spent time exploring and all that we weren't like well we didn't no we didn't not that we didn't have to but, like we definitely leveled up a lot just by playing the story it so far is sad that of the three two is the superior three is a close second but like it's got some choices that not everyone likes like, I know the equipment option is probably not everyone's favorite. I can tell. Just just having me dealing with it, I'm just like, yeah. If I can avoid it, we're not going to do anything. Like, I'm not going to lose sleep if I don't have to do the uh, equipment stuff too much. Head back. I know it's gonna put me over 80, but like, I don't care. It's 
So we, we didn't even finish looking around the area, so it's like, the other's gonna get level up too, so. You want to head back to West City really quick. Because you know, Bulma's mother can wash those, uh, the dirty clothes we found. Um, ba -dum -bum. West City should be right there. No? No. West City is over here. Like it's somewhere. Okay, Alma's mother, please. Oh my goodness, those gloves are filthy. Why don't you give them to me? I'll wash them for you. Oh, you can only do one at a time? That's annoying. Um, four. Heading on back to the forest. What we'll do next episode is uh, actually do the search for Bobby's ship. So we got the th we got the three of us to level eighty. Actually, hold on. I know what we're gonna do. I know I said that, but I want to check out. I want to see if, if after I sell all my gear, how much do we wind up having to work with? Shopping wise. Not drinks. Not food. Oh, we can't sell. Can we buy? That's dumb. Oops, my bad. Is there a store? I think there's a, yeah, there's a, there's a store in Hercule City. Check out the store, and then we'll uh, go from there. Where is the... I always fucking... <sighs> Alright, store. Sell. I don't know what we're gonna do with those, so... Is it Lazarus Crystal? What is the crystal for? What do they do though? It says keep one on you. When you die this orb. Oh! We're keeping these. So a Lazarus crystal will revive you if you die. Oh. Did not know that. Okay. 20 or 30 level tops in each game. Wait, you gain levels like crazy, but it's always good to get at least 20 or 30 levels tops in each game chapter for a new area. 
So you want to be at least 10 to 15 levels above the, whatever doors you find. Okay, so next time... Oh, I didn't mean to do that shit. Can I buy it back? Can't. Fuck. Oh well. Um, so you know, the game says be 10 or 15 levels higher than um, any of the doors. So we want to be 85. 85 or 90 before we progress uh, the Bobbity ship. That We can work with that. So next time we'll, we'll work on boosting the three of them more. I, I wish I knew there was that kind of thing. So you want to get 20 or so levels per chapter. That's fine. We can, we, now that we know that, it's fine. So what we'll do... That actually makes sense though, given like what the, level, the max level is. Okay, we can only get this one for now. Okay, now next time we will work on getting Goku, Vegeta, and Trunks to, I mean, Goku, Vegeta, and Gohan to like 85, 90 in the Southwest Forest before progressing the story. That, you know, now that we know. And also, we know not to get rid of the Lazarus crystals. Damn, I didn't know those things were five does. It just says, oh, you're lucky. Was I supposed to know that's what it meant? All right, though, so that'll do it for this episode. Hopefully you enjoyed it. And if you guys are playing these yourselves, now you know what that crystal does. And um, hopefully it'll be helpful in the future. So, yeah, take it easy. Have a lovely time zone. And I'll see you next video. Bye-bye.